You can catch a free ride on Jacksonville Transportation Authority's First Coast Flyer this week. If you're trying to get to the beaches, JTA launched the new red line that operates between the Rosa Parks Station downtown to Jacksonville Beach. News 4 Jacks reporter Crystal Moyer tells us how the red line is offering quick, convenient transportation. Breaking through the banner. <laughs> JTA rolled out the new Red Line First Coast Flyer. It operates from downtown to Jacksonville Beach using the Arlington Expressway, Southside Boulevard, and Beach Boulevard. The new route replaces the beach shuttles and stops about every mile with 10-minute frequency during peak hours. The Red Line buses are expected to make about 1,800 stops a day and also comes with some new technology. Those digital boards have real-time information on bus routes, weather, and news. Along with new buses, JTA hired 33 additional drivers to cover the expanded route. The project costs more than $30 million, half covered by federal funding. Federal Transit Administrator Kay Jane Williams praises CEO Nat Ford and JTA for thinking outside the box when it comes to transportation. He's really talked about mobility and not mode and using innovation to connect people to greater opportunities. After the free trial is up, the red line will cost riders $1.50 per trip or four bucks for a day pass. JTA also launched a new Nassau Express Select service and Ready Ride on demand ride service. Crystal Moyer, Channel 4 The Local Station.